Okay, so what we have here is the clock drill setup. We've got the 12 o'clock, 3 o'clock, 6 o'clock, and 9 o'clock positions um, set up there with the tees. And I used my putter to measure the length. And I'll just give a little demonstration here. You can see the ball's already set up. And then I'm going to go ahead and put around and just show you uh, basically how you want to do this. And uh, the game or the drill um, completion percentage or completion numbers are per your handicap. And that's going to be on the table um, on the PDF or on the page. So basically you just stick your putter in here. Boom, that's one tee. I usually go straight across and just try and match it up. Boom, that's another one. And then do the same with the other ones there. So first you want, don't spend a whole lot of time, it's only a three foot putt, but you're going to want to read this a little bit so you kind of learn the breaks. And again, ideally you want um, straight putts, you want right to left, you want left to right. And usually on greens, it's not too hard to get that. Okay, on to the next one. Okay, so that miss means I have to start from the beginning again, which I will do. Uh, uh, so my intention here is to go at least one time around without missing. All right, finally. So there's my once around. Um, tour players are expected to go around 10 times without missing. I think I've done that once. Um, zero to 10, five times, and it goes down from that as your handicap um, is bigger or higher. Anyway, this is an excellent drill. It just breathes a lot of confidence once you go through it a lot and it builds up over the weeks and you know the months that you're no longer scared to go up to a putt and just knock it in, you have a lot of confidence. And uh, anyway, that is the clock drill.